The Q Eisen Art Golf Resort and Spa sits on 275 beachfront acres on Anguilla's Rendezvous Bay. The front entrance is a stately affair. The buildings are inspired by the bright whites and deep blues of the Greek island of Santorini. The main building has beachfront and sea view suites, some with two bedrooms. Reaching from the lobby to the beach bar, the infinity pool has a long canal that flows to the ocean's edge. The pool at night. Another view of the infinity pool, with St. Martin in the background. There are comfy couches near the pool. The two-mile beach called Rendezvous Bay is one of 33 beaches on the island and one of the calmest, with a gentle surf that invites even the squeamish of swimmers. The beach hosts sunrise joggers, afternoon nappers and sunset watchers. For those looking for something more active, water activity coordinators arrange kayaking, snorkeling, Hobie cat sails and gratis yoga classes on the beach. Signs make the resort easy to navigate. Ten-star quiet buildings with suites face the sea. The buildings are each named for a Greek island, like Mykonos, Rhodes and Simi. Palms tower over the buildings. Sunset over the villas. For families or couples who like a lot of space, beachfront villas and garden view villas fit the bill. This is the entrance to the Oasis Villa. The dining room in the Oasis Villa. The Oasis Villa is elegantly furnished. The master bedroom in the Oasis Villa. The Oasis Villa has its own backyard with a pool. The entrance to the Mykonos building. Suites are airy with high ceilings, colorful Mediterranean-inspired art and sliding glass doors that open to patios and balconies. This is the living room in a Sea View Junior Suite. The bedroom of a Sea View Junior Suite. The patio of a Sea View Junior Suite. The view from a Sea View Junior Suite. Suites have colorful art. The living room in a deluxe Junior Suite. The bedroom of a deluxe Junior Suite. Marble bathrooms are bigger than some apartments in Manhattan. The suites have big tubs. The patio of a deluxe junior suite. 
If you're in a suite with one or two bedrooms, the bathrooms have an adjacent solarium for au natural dining. A bowl of cherry tomatoes from the resort's hydroponic garden are the resort's alternative to mints on the pillow. The hydroponic garden is the first of its kind at a Caribbean resort. Getting vegetables and herbs to grow without having to water them is a big plus in a dry climate like Anguilla's. A basket of eggplants and peppers grown in the hydroponic garden. Vegetables and herbs served in the restaurants are grown in the hydroponic garden. The herb garden in the center of the resort is stocked with mint, basil, and chives. Kickstart the morning with the continental breakfast, included in room rates, at Cafe Mediterraneo. Cafe Mediterraneo offers open air dining by the pool. Breakfast poolside starts with a feel the burn smoothie made with carrots, ginger, apples, and oranges. Or a green zing juice with arugula, green pepper, celery, green apple, parsley, and ginger. Breads and pastries at Cafe Mediterraneo. The breakfast buffet at Cafe Mediterraneo. Bread stuffed with olives and prosciutto at Cafe Mediterraneo. The pistachio bread at Cafe Mediterraneo is baked daily. A lobster dinner at any one of Anguilla's restaurants can run as high as $65. This makes the Saturday night all-you-can-eat lobster barbecue a relative deal at $95. The buffet is a bonanza of salads, slow-cooked brisket, jerk chicken, lamb tacos, pasta, grilled fish, barbecue ribs and Anguilla's spiny lobsters. Lobsters are served warm from the charcoal grill with butter, lemon, herbs and capers. Chocolate lollipops and pistachio cake for dessert at the lobster barbecue. Few ice and arts restaurants are led by executive chef Jasper Schneider. The Italia restaurant offers dining overlooking the golf course. Green pesto pasta at Italia. Italia's mini green frozen white rum Maggito. Stop at the lobby bar for a shot of the house-made gingery rum, an artsy cocktail or a French Chablis or Oki Chardonnay from California. At the water's edge, the beach bar stays open until 6 p.m. for fruity frozen drinks and light bites. Tokyo Bay is the island's first sushi restaurant. Sliced tuna at Tokyo Bay. Sashimi at Tokyo Bay. Tokyo Bay Chef Joe Richardson. In the same round building as the spa, sushi, sashimi and teppanyaki come with 360-degree views of the sea and St. Martin. Try the rainbow-colored rolls and lobster and mushroom dumplings with a bottle of gold gekkensei. 
The Venus Spa keeps the resort's relaxing theme in a chalk-white dome-shaped building that looks more like a spaceship than a spa. H20 treatments are popular, like a scrub and a soak in the saltwater healing waters pool with built-in seats and hydrotherapy jets. The resort offers an 18-hole Greg Norman designed golf course, the only one on the island. The course greets players with views of the sea and St. Martin. The Basketball Court The Bochi Ball Courts From St. Martin, a Juby Express ferry takes 20 minutes to get to Anguilla.